Hey there Star Wars fans and collectors, welcome to another Star Wars The Clone Wars action figure review. For today's action figure review, it will be on the brand new 2011 action figure, the first figure from the brand new 2011 Wave 1 of the Clone Wars uh, figure line. He is Clone Wars number 40 and it is Obi-Wan Kenobi. Um, this is a remake of the review. I had previously reviewed him, but by the time you guys are all watching this video, um, I will have deleted my first review on it because I just wanted to make this um, uh, a lot more high quality if possible um, and just a better review and since I have the other figures from its wave, well, you know, it'd be nice to show all of them in the back and stuff. Okay, but anyway, um, let's get reviewing the packaging. Obviously, you have Star Wars The Clone Wars logo right there. You have Obi Wan in his new look, which looks amazing. I like it very, very much. You have the Galactic Battle Game card, okay, with a die over there. Yeah, includes lightsaber and the Hasbro logo, ages four and up. The warning. CW40, Obi Wan Kenobi, and the Republic symbol. All brand new 2011 um, action figures will include this sticker for the brand new Star Wars The Clone Wars Adventures game. Um, as you guys can see, it's a free 30 day membership plus 450 station cash. For those of you who doesn't have an account, I don't have an account, so once I get a computer, um, I can you know, make myself a member and have a 30 day membership and all that stuff. So that's really cool. The figure itself in the packaging looks awesome okay then we have the back you have Obi-Wan Kenobi's name of course his number you have this awesome looking picture of him from the Mortis trilogy I'm assuming okay his little uh, bio you guys can go ahead and um, pause that and read if you'd like you have uh, Obi-Wan's um, picture includes lightsaber each figure has a unique card, collect them all each sold separately. Okay. Visit StarWars.Hasbro.com, Hasbro logos, the action figures in this new wave. Okay, another Star Wars the Clone Wars logo. Play the Galactic Battle Game, etc. So um you have that pretty much. Okay. Overall, the packaging is really nice. I like it very much. I like it. I'm very happy. Okay. So now, I'll give you Obi-Wan Kenobi. Obi-Wan includes um, his Galactic Battle Game card. Okay. A die little pamphlet showing off figures from Vintage Collection and Clone Wars and Saga Legends, etc. And here's the little pamphlet that you uh, use to um, go to, you know, make your membership and get 450 station cash and other things. The code's on the back, but I'm not going to give it up because I'm going to use it. Okay, and for accessories, oh yeah, he also brings a stand, but for accessories he does bring his trusty lightsaber. Okay, so let's go over his articulation. He does have a bull jointed head, bull hinged shoulders, bull hinged elbows, swivel wrist, swivel waist, um, swivel hips, and bull hinged knees. He has no articulation whatsoever in the ankles, which that's unfortunate for all you, uh, you know, fans who love articulation and all that stuff. They could have made it though. I mean, I'm surprised that for 2011 figures they didn't do that. You know, lots of 2010 have them and yet they didn't make them for these. So I guess that's a really minus for that. But oh well. Um, overall, the figure looks really good. Let's give a nice close up. So you guys can see his uh, sculpted face. And it's kind of focusing there. Uh, he does look really good. Probably the best Obi-Wan figure that has been sculpted today. See, there you go, not focused. Really great. He does look just like, you know, Obi-Wan right there in the picture. As 
you guys can see. Okay, I'm gonna give you a look of him on 360. So overall, he's a really great Obi-Wan. Obviously, with his new look, he removed all of the clone trooper parts except for the two gauntlets that he has. Over here, he has like a little symbol right there. And over here, he has the communicator where he communicates with his fellow Jedi and clone troopers. So overall, he's a really great figure. I highly recommend you picking up Obi-Wan. You know, he is a must have for your Star Wars collection. I love it very very much. My favorite Clone Wars Obi-Wan that I own today. Um, and I have three out of four Obi-Wans. I never got the Orto Plutonia or the Cold Weather Gear Obi-Wan. So um, This makes up for it. From a rating from 1 to a 10 I'll give him a good um, I'll give him a good 8.5 you know, artic you know, when it comes to the articulation and the ankles, I have to, you know, lower his rating. And also because it doesn't bring that many accessories, so, you know, that's also a minus. You know, it only brings his lightsaber. At least they could have brought an unlit lightsaber, you know, just the lightsaber hilt, so you can hang it up on there and probably a cloak. Yeah. So, um, thanks a lot, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. Um... Please comment, rate, and subscribe. Um, and until next time, my friends, may the Force be with you.